Hello, welcome to this uh, another video uh, where I show you a little thing I found out um, some days ago. Pretty cool stuff. Didn't know about that. And it's really, really nice. So it's about uh, creating stuff like 3D maze uh, from an image. So let's get started. It's very, very, very easy. First, we create a plane. Scale it up to where we want it. And now it's uh, about you create your own black and white image or anything like that. I have here, for instance, this one. And we're going to use this to create geometry out of this uh, information. Um, so it works with this tool here. It's um, modify, convert, texture to geometry. So let's call that. Now first we need to call the image properties. Let's uh, put the input image. So my is um, new maze open. Now um, I still don't know exactly how all of these attributes um, work. We could look up the help for internet and yeah, the, uh, the attributes are explained there, but however, so these settings work. So let's choose apply and close. Now Maya calculates stuff and now it's done. So what it did is it creates uh, an extra plane as we see in our outliner and parents it un under the initial plane. So we can unparent that and delete our first plane. And here we have our maze. So, cool thing about this is if we go to the hypershade and see here, it created actually two new shaders and assigned them already to the faces. So that's perfect for us because now we only we just can say, um, okay, we want to we want to keep the walls, which is the black color. So let's select all of the white um, faces, select objects with material, and just delete them. And what we're left with is this super cool um, maze mesh. Now what we need to do is extrude that. Mm. Move it like that. And give it a new shader. Let's let's assign this back to Lambert one, and rotate it uh, back in X. And now uh, here we go. Here's our super cool 3D maze. I have made some other mazes, so let me show you one other. You need to to make some tweaks. Um, I think it was this one. Yep, and yeah, you need to let me show you another maze. Like, I tried it with this one, and obviously, this didn't work pretty good because it's a huge maze. And oh, oh, here, so this is I already um, applied a like a bookshelf texture to this. So see if I if I remove if I move out. You see it's a circular maze. And you know you can get pretty cool things out of this. I don't know where a production would ever need such a complete maze, but I I think it's like fun to maybe use this geometry, put it inside a game engine and run around and see if you can find the, the key. Or whatever is 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 it what you're looking for inside the maze? So you see here's the entrance, and then yeah, have fun finding here. So pretty cool stuff. That's what I wanted to show you. Hope you enjoy, and see you next time.